today we're going to do a Cooper run, 12 minute Cooper run. You're going to run for 12 minutes as far as you can. We're going to measure it on the track um, and then we'll estimate your VAT max from that. It's, um, it's a good way of estimating your VAT max outside the lab. It's quite accurate. All you need to do is run for 12 minutes and just a, a means of measuring your distance, whether you use a GPS watch, uh, you run it on a 400 meter track or even around a football pitch, as long as you know how far each lap is. Research has shown that it's about an 85 to 90% correlation between the distance run and someone's VAT max. And they measured their VAT max in a lab, and then obviously they, they measured their Cooper on times, and the correlation was about 90%, which is very accurate. Um, it's an accurate means of measuring outside of a lab. It, it's more accurate than a bleep test or any other fitness test. Aaron, 12 minutes, Cooper on test. Go. So today we did a 12 minute Cooper run. As the name suggests, it's a 12 minute run. The aim of running as far as you can within that 12 minutes. Uh, we'll put a link in the description. If you put how far you've run within that 12 minutes, it'll give you an estimate of VO2 max, basically value of your aerobic performance, how fit you are as an endurance athlete. Right, now it's your turn to test yourself. Get out there, run for 12 minutes, find out how far you can run. Click on the link in the description below, enter your distance, and calculate your VO2 max and put your distance in the comments below and we'll see who is the fittest.